Yeah, I just came to Oakville Trafalgar High School. school for their kids where I am today I'm actually in Oakville Trafalgar High School and this high school is one of the top schools in the country not just Ontario but actually in the country let me tell you a little bit about Oakville Trafalgar Secondary School it was established in 1908 and this school played a major role in the First World War and also the Second World War. The soccer field was actually turned into a place where they grow crops that was sent to the troops overseas. And if you go inside the school, there were 35 students that actually fought within the Second World War who actually died and they are emblem in the school. The school is the top ranking high school, not in only in Ontario, but actually in Canada as a whole. And if you look at the McLean ranking, this school for 2020 was in the top 10 schools in Ontario. And also we can testify that it has produced a lot of quiet, significant alumni over time. Some of them include top journalists, top filmmakers, top people in their field, also Olympus gold medalists. As the camera move around, this is the front of the school and right now as I speak it's actually the spring and the trees are going to be starting coming up very very soon. The location of this school is in the South Oakville right by the Lakeshore area and it's very close to Appleby Secondary School which is also another prominent school in the area. This school has received a lot of accolades and a lot of uh, talent has been produced in this building as we speak right here. So I'm going to be taking you to the back to show you what the school also have at the back. So right here is at the back of the school. And here you can see a little mini playing area where the kids can actually come here and play. And you can see some school benches and also a little mini hats and some trees that has been planted at the back of the school for the kids to come in. I believe this is also a daycare attached to the school and kids can actually come here and also play in this area. This school has a very significant history and it's very, very important that we recognize that. So right here is the front of the school and here the students can also pack their bicycles as you can see. And in front of me, you also can see the parking lot in that area. And I'll do a little quick 360 view to show you all the school around. This is the main entrance to the school. And right now, because of the COVID, there's some restrictions and there's some online classes also going on. Right here is the parking lot of the school. Quite big and it can contain majority of cars. And here I am heading towards where the soccer field was, which also holds a quite significant interest in the First World War and also the Second World War. So this soccer field that I'm gonna be taking you to is actually the place where all the crops were planted when there was a war going on in Europe for the First World War and also World War II. So basically, as I've mentioned before, crops were grown up in this field and the troops were actually using these crops for their food. 
So hopefully I'll be able to take you very there soon. But this is the school that has been established since the 1908 and it holds a place in the Canadian history because of all the contribution that it did for the World War I and World War II. Here I'm taking you back to the parking lot to give you a more view of the school. Very closer to the parking and I'm heading towards to the soccer field where significant events took place. So this is a very, very important milestone today for me to be here. It's like my third time being in this area. But this is actually the first time that I'm doing a video recording. So right in front of me is the soccer field of Oakville Trafalgar High School. And this is the soccer field where crops were grown during the World War I and also the World War II for the Canadian soldiers that fought overseas. It's quite a milestone for me to be here today to be videotaping this school, showcasing all the significant role that it played in the First World War I and also the First World War II. As you can see, it's a very quiet open space, very quiet neighborhood, very prestigious. And as the camera move around in 360 view, showing the back of the school leading to the parking lot. It's a very prestigious neighborhood right by the lake shore, right by the Applebee College. So this is just a little glimpse to show you where such an event has taken place. And as you can see, some couples are also walking on the soccer field track. This is what is beautiful about Canada is that in a neighborhood like this, abilities for the school can also be used by the neighbors that live nearby. Hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope you subscribe to the channel. Thank you. This here is a little hangout spot with some memory stones where the students can actually come here and enjoy their quiet time. Quite lovely. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe. Please subscribe, okay? Help the channel grow. Alright, it's your boy KB. Touch base soon.